our planet teems with life. Roughly 1.75 million species have been formally identified, but biologists realise that this must only be a fraction of the real number of different plants and animals on Earth. The most diverse ecosystems occur in the shallow tropical oceans based around coral reefs. Rainforests are also very rich in communities of plants and animals that are all independent. These areas produce a large proportion of the oxygen we need to live. Natural organic cycles replenish the atmosphere and purify water. Clean, fresh water is becoming a scarce resource, with rivers depleted by intensive agriculture. The Earth's human population will soon reach 7 billion, requiring extra land to live on, to grow food on, and to produce the resources that humans like to have. And our machines eat up resources too. Our numbers keep multiplying, our consumption keeps increasing, and our economic system is based on growth. All this expansion is having consequences. Iconic species that need large amounts of space to live are being squeezed into fringe lands that are under pressure from deforestation, expanding agricultural demands and ultimately the pressures that come with an expanding human population. As a result, most wild populations are in decline. One vital species that has been hit hard by the modern world is the honeybee. Different conditions are causing beehives to die. If the trend continues, most of the food crops that rely on the bee for pollination will start failing.